Okay guys, two things about today's video. First thing, Rumble matchup. I used to actually struggle a lot in this matchup, but there was something that I failed to see is how stronger you are level one. And actually level one, if you manage to abuse your advantage, you can actually snowball from that and can get pretty out of hand. So that's something to, to keep in mind. Also, they're nerfing Rumble on patch 14.2, so it's gonna get even easier from now. Second thing, it's it's a thematic, it's a subject that we all know as side laners, as split pushers. You are gonna have games where where you know that you win the side lane, you know that you win the split, but whenever you're going on the side lane, your team doesn't even let you the time to have pressure to do something, and they will take stupid fights, and they will die on CD. And then you're thinking, okay, then maybe maybe I should group, but but then you're not using your champ to its best, and, and it's, a, it's a tough situation that keeps happening at any ELO. So... This is a never-ending process of knowing where you should group, when you should split. There's no short answer that you can just follow every game. Uh, you need to listen to your guts. You need to listen to or read the game, read the map, read what's happening. But something that I realized that I failed to do for quite a long time is that if you're doing something, you need to commit to it. If you're deciding on split pushing, you're split pushing. If you decide on grouping, you group. You don't go halfsies, you know? Uh, so I got a bit emotional on that one i don't know if i made the best decisions at every at every point but at least i sticked to my decisions and i think that was good enough so yeah enjoy the video guys much love <laughs> Hey guys, hope everyone is doing well. We're playing on the Smurf right now. I mean, the Smurf is kind of the same LP and MMR than the main. I went 9 and 1 in multiple days because I don't play like that many games per day, but I play high quality games. So yeah, I'm 9 and 1 in the last 10 games. Uh, so the account is in Diamond 1. And I think that people who are in diamond one right now is most likely masters 100 to 300 lp last season so so yeah we're having a decent decent games decent mmr so let's see what they have here facing rumble with ignite i was not sure who i was facing so i went hp per level um let's see bot lane aphidios medio okay which is good hyper carry with some peeling uh into various karma um various doesn't seem to be playing poke i think like if karma and various went poke it could have been like pretty oppressive but then we have fleet and milieu cls um how how would it <coughs> sorry i'm a bit sick how would it play bot uh play out bots i think i am your worst i think they would probably have prior though with various karma um, I mean, the way you see it is like whoever gets a lead will will outscale. They 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 both have really good scaling. I'm not too sure about this. Now Nico into Yone. Most likely mid lane is a scale matchup. Uh. And the thing with Yone is that she can actually play into anything. Oh, that happened. Okay. I mean, can I not dive him? Nice. That's a pretty nice way to start the game for me, at least.
Yeah, Rumble is pretty tough for Tryndamere, but early on, if you manage to fight him before he gets uh, hit bar stacked up. I don't think Prayer is doing. I would maybe have to cover that. Okay, she got it in time. Wait, she didn't come. Okay, she's coming now. There's no flash. Nice. Careful about Bearweth. Should I probably crash this wave? Uh, but maybe you can actually crash the next one. Will I get level 6? If I get level 6, I can actually maybe look for a dive. Six, we can fight this. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So, it's a bit sad that bot lane lost because uh, Briar came back from that bad early. And they lost 2v2. And as I said, it, it can snowball, I believe, pretty hard. Okay, I'm going for a slow push and looking to dive Rumble on the crash. He has two pinks. Bro has zero gold and he buys two pinks. What the fuck? Okay, we actually have Prayo for Drake. If we get both Drake and and grabs, it's pretty insane. Okay, if I manage to dive him... Okay... Just wanted to get uh, what it's called... Bone plating... Okay, big mistake by him... Mistake by me, also... The W... I see everyone on map. An ally has been slain. Okay, 
Nice, we got the Drake. This spawn soon, I will have my ult. And... And items. Nah, how does she give that shutdown? Why do you come back? Yeah. It was so good. We can play this. Oh, this, this, bro. It's in 40, you cannot do like bot to top. She had the time to do like one, two, three camps and then play them. I'm gonna make ult for grubs. I'm strong. Look at her. She's so late. I mean, she can come straight and then do her top games after grubs, though. Yo, Milio, we asked you to come. Okay, Karma is not there though. Hello? But hello, why are you doing blue buff? Uh... They're sleeping, man. My blade. Wait, I have a hundred percent KP. What the fuck? It's tempting to dive him now. But what can I give? I, like, I, I can give 700 gold. Or I could just go and buy Kraken and then kill him again whenever I want and get my plates before 14. Okay, above this is bot, but I wasn't completely sure about that. She could have went, she could have came back straight to top. So I actually went in early and did not wait for the wave to crash because if the wave crashes he can ult and and like die for his wave protecting it, you know. If I kill him first, well he has no wave. I was gonna say I don't know where Yuna is. So the E was a bit greedy. And now I can actually look for mid prior. An enemy has been slain. And go straight into Drake. I don't have 100% KP anymore. Nice. 
we want to play for Navari, I believe. Okay, good job, Briar. Yeah, people have gotten better at this champ. Don't like this. Yeah, we did our play already. We played on our turn. This is not our turn anymore. And now we're late for Herald again. When I'm perfectly on time. See. Do we have TP on? We don't even have TP on Nico. Yeah. Sorry, Belveth. Yeah, wait, wait, it's me, your bot again. Okay, I guess they're too scared of me. Rightfully. I should. Okay, well, I'm playing this. I'm strong. Remember, it's coming, no? Your turret has been destroyed. Okay, Drake in two. Again, like that's that's so not the play. Oh shit, I have the bug. I have the camera bug. Yo, oh, focus. On. That's something, when you're a giga fed. Okay, that's suicide for T1. Okay, see everyone. An ally has been slain. Your team has destroyed a turret. I'm basing and going straight to bots. I come bot, don't stay now. Here. Uh, shit. Why do I have so many bugs? Okay. Yeah, but don't base now as well, Medio. Okay, 
we can just we can just do it, I think. Or did they just all have flashes? I feel like everyone flashed. Also, they are all on 1 HP. But we get what we played for. Okay, back now. Sure, but I don't have ghost this time, but I have flash. They used a ton. But Nico, come on, one five, bro, in, in such an easy game. It's dying. Good thing that Smidio saves his ass. What? What are we doing? I'm saying I pressure, then I come. I pressure, and by the time I come, they're dead. Oi, oi, oi. Hello, Nico, straight. Okay, nice. I, I guess I can't pressure. I pressure, then I come. One min. Give me. If he gets caught, I mean, I would just stop, stop splitting, you know. Okay. It's okay, like if we don't see an opportunity. Yo, Milio, Milio, what? But what? Like that's why that's why I don't wanna just side. Because I I could side and dive and kill. But I feel like by this time they're all dead. So let's play this first and it's gonna make rotations easier. Like exactly. But for what? Okay, never mind. Okay. Kinda panic ulted. Not gonna lie. I should have like I, I could have flash ghosted killed everyone. I just I just thought it was not good from the start because the video is not there. 
could have been good. It's okay, they used... They used shit. I have my rage bleeds. But I've, I should have bought the pink ward. Oh, okay. I could base, but I feel you can't base. No, but don't flip Nash for Drake for Soul. Just get Soul. Uh, like we're, we're we're gonna we're gonna give soul, and we're not even gonna get Nash. That's exactly what's gonna happen. Like, what the fuck? Uh, I mean, what is this? Why do I go back in? But legit, the only reason it kind of works, it's because, like... And like the only reason I would understand why they would be scared to actually take this is because they they're scared of of elder. As you wish. That would be like the only reason why. But even this, I, I wouldn't agree with it. Now this is a 50-50 on paper. If we don't go an hour early. Well, there's only one, one Nash left. Like I'm, 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 I'm me top. I'm gonna play the splits. What can I say? Like, when I come to them and make a play with them, they decide to go and try to, like, trade Nash for Drake or whatever. So... So I'm just not gonna do it.
I just to think. take a lot here. Maybe stack rage blades. my team <laughs> legit <laughs> ah sometimes it's hard for me to keep my cool still bro like why why do you make easy things so hard i mean i'm the one taking cold showers you know so so what can i say uh let's honor no one Yeah, I guess I guess I was able to split at the end. I mean, I don't know much. Like, I I, I would probably need to rewatch that game just to understand like when I decided that the play was to apply pressure and group. Was it actually the right play? Could I have not just split or splitted? And when I decided to split, could I have not grouped? And the thing is, you, you, you could be very result-oriented and see, okay, I split here and it worked, thus it was good. I grouped here and it didn't work, thus it was bad, but it's not how it works. It's like, what was like the overall most like thoughtful, smart, consistent play? I don't know. I, I would probably rewatch re the VOD when I, when I post it. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this. Uh, next time will be... Well, tomorrow, same time, same place. Until then, guys, take care of yourselves. Good luck and have fun in game and in real life. And I will see you next time. Peace, guys. Much love. Bye-bye.